thought we did really, really well in the first half. We should have went in 2-0, unfortunate. And uh, the second half, it was, it was 90 degrees when the game started, so that had a little bit to do with it. We were out three defenders, Len, Thomas, and Josh. So we had three new guys, basically. Well, Raph has paid some back there, so that didn't help matters, you know. So I know injuries sound like an excuse, but it's the reality. But all in all, we can take the positives out. We had our chances. We played really, really well. And sometimes it happens with, uh, you know, Simon, who's our goal scorer guy, that uh, sometimes you just don't finish and you get into a little bit of a rut. Hopefully he keeps his confidence up and tomorrow he gets back. It's going to be a tough game. Uh, watch them on tape against Brown. They've got a big international flavor. And they're strong. They played on Saturday night. They played overtime on Saturday night. So uh, we have to press them. We have to really get after it. And, you know, we're at home, so we got to take the game to them. We did well in the first half, and if we had the goals, then it's easier kind of to defend that part of it. And you can, you don't have to make changing, you know, you know, you get yourself stretched when you're trying to catch up, you know, so hopefully we get ahead. We need to get ahead. We need to score the first goal, and we need them to chase the game and not us. Well, we definitely have to be positive and take out the good things that we had in that game. Uh, we had a really strong first half, as you mentioned. We played well. We had more chances. We could have scored. And second half, we got to learn from our mistakes. We got to learn that defensively, we got to be more compact and more consistent. And taking it forward, um, we have a huge week coming up. Tuesday, Friday, probably the two most important games of the season. So from Rhode Island, we expect a really uh, defensive team. They're good. They won some important games. They come from two ties, 0-0. So we're expecting a very defensive team and we got to take it out to them, pressure them and, and go for it. Right now, uh, we're in, in half the season, eight games to go, we've played eight games, we've got to pick it up and do well to make it to the offseason. I feel it's not only Louisville, like we played against Clemson, Notre Dame, Louisville, three top team, top ten like, teams in the country and I think that we proved that we can compete with all of them and it's just cutting out the mistakes and staying compact and um, just staying focused 90 minutes and I think if you do that we can we can beat any country, any team. I mean we know Rhode Island is a really defensive team, haven't conceded a goal in a while um, so we really need to get after them and try to score early because we know that we get a lot of chances in the beginning of the game so we just need to capitalize and build off that so we don't need to chase and hope on a late goal. Um, it's a big game, um, Virginia Tech 2 on Friday, it's an ACC game that we need to win um, at home so it's a must win game.